pretty much. For the last like three, maybe four even years, my New Year's resolution, my goal for the year has been to make a film that is not for a school project or for a competition. And in September of 2023, I did that. Uh, it was very spur of the moment. Some friends and I, we were like, let's make a film tonight completely unplanned, fully improvised. We just like looked at what we had around us and we made something and it was really fun. It was really satisfying and I'm glad that I completed my goal. But my New Year's resolution for this year is to do that more. So this year, 2024, every week I will be filming something. Whether it's like I was talking about earlier, something that I just make in one night, in one day, no planning, just improvise. Or whether it's one scene of a much larger project, every week I'm gonna film something. That's the goal. The idea for this came from, um, I was watching the behind the scenes of Bad Taste, which is Peter Jackson's first feature length film. Every week, Peter Jackson, he would work, he was like in his early 20s, just like me, whoa. He would work six days a week to be able to afford film, 16 millimeter film, which he was shooting the film on, the, the movie on. Then on his one day off on Sunday, for four years he did this, on Sunday he would film stuff. No written script, just he would think of things while he was working during the week, he would buy film, and then he would shoot on the Sunday. Now, I'm sitting here thinking, I work five days a week, and I don't need to pay for film. I shoot on digital, which is free. So what am I doing? Why am I not shooting something every Sunday like he did? Or every Saturday and Sunday? So that's the whole idea. This could be the arm for the sink on the Hi, YouTube. <laughs> My other inspiration behind this is Joel Hayden, a YouTuber who I really um, like. He, every week, films, edits, and uploads a short film. Um, usually completely improvised. Actually, I think it's always completely improvised. And, um, yeah, just stuff like that. I'm like, I should be doing that. So that's what I'm doing. Um, there's this idea, in fact I don't even know if I should call it an idea, because, you know, regardless of what a story is about, that, when it was, it will, the story will reflect the mind state and the life and the, the location of the writer when they wrote it. Even if it's not conscious, even if they don't mean to do that, subconsciously, it will come through. If I'm not making anything, I'm kind of missing out on that. I'm, you know, could be like chronicling my entire life, uh, creating these these documents, these records of of what the world was like when I was, you know, where I am, where and when I am today. And I'm not doing that. So if I film something every week, that's going to be a sort of record for the future, um, a record which I won't have otherwise. <laughs> Um, what was I talking about? Stipulation. Oh yeah, and I'm also going to say that um, if I help someone else with filming their project, that counts as well. Um, in the last few months of 2023, I helped out a local production studio filmmaking group. A local filmmaking group called One Dollar Genre. Um, and their, their thing is that they make a film every month. So. I've been helping out uh, with lighting and, and audio and stuff for that, so I'm going to say that counts as well, just so that I'm not completely overwhelmed. I'm allowing sort of vlog style, style stuff like this. Jeez, I suppose I am a vlogger now. I didn't think about that. Even though this isn't exactly one of what I want to be focusing on, I want to be doing more like narrative um, stuff with like stories and special effects and stuff but um this is still you know practicing the craft I'm still familiarizing myself with like cinematography and camera angles and that anyway so if you know me in real life or even if you don't I suppose and you wanna 
you have any ideas for a film, I'm gonna be looking for ideas all year. Um, so yeah, approach me. I would love to collaborate with new people, even people who aren't like that experienced in filmmaking. I'm sure you still have great ideas, um, so reach out, please. Oof, smells like I haven't showered since last year.